Alright, so you start File, Open New. Uh, on the bottom right, you have a new button. And uh, we'll just save it as Test or Test 78. Why not? Um, these will probably be set. Make sure it's US survey feed in degrees. Um, the azimuth and grid direction don't matter. Control file, we don't need that for these. Okay. Okay, so new job. Um, UTM coordinate system, you can just look up, make sure you're in the right grid. I recommend using NAD 1983. So for this section, make sure it's all zeros throughout. Uh, so it's going to be zero exactly where, above where the instrument's going to be. And then from there, go to the main menu, Traverse Side Shot. And on the top it says backside is not set, so go bottom left, hit backside. Uh, PPM, it automatically calculates. Height of instrument, we measured out to be 3.12. So set circle, that's going to be the line in which the circle is set. Once it makes that noise, that's good. Finish. All right, now we're gonna do the side shot. Are you gonna go there? Yeah, no, they're gonna go by. <laughs> That's cool. Need a taking in progress sign. I got you. Okay. Sorry. Okay, so hold it with. I need a C three. All right, it's a little more to my left. Yeah. Your left? Yeah. Um, a little bit more. A little bit more. Right there. Okay. So then you hit side shot. Hit enter. Alright, so then you'll go to the map, click your point. So the northern is the distance from the instrument, so it's saying 7.686. Sounds about right. The elevation's off though. Well, you can turn it off the recording. 